Now to a developing story. We obtained records that show investigators looked into allegations of possible alcohol abuse at the Gwinnett County home where a mother and her daughters died in a fire. I would hate for him to go through this if it really was an accident. But Evelyn Parker says she can't help but wonder what caused the February fatal fire that killed friend Kathy Patterson and her two daughters. Neighbors say they're heartbroken for survivor Brent Patterson, but at the same time are confused over emerging details of the Patterson family life. So seeing and just looking just, is perfect. Yeah. You know? And now you wonder. And you wonder what was actually happening down there. I'm trying to do a welfare check on a family. In 2014, a division of family and children's services worker called 911 as she tried to do a welfare check. Um, we have reports of possible alcohol abuse and the mother driving intoxicated with the children. Records show the Pattersons called the allegations false. And after several visits, DFAX dropped the case, finding no signs of maltreatment. In interviews with investigators since the fire, Brent Patterson has pointed to his wife's use of prescription medicine as a reason she may not have been able to escape the fire. Authorities are waiting on toxicology and other tests as they search for a cause. There's nothing I can do. Investigators say they're looking at several angles from accidental to arson. You know, then to be, was it prosecuted in front, you know, everyone in the neighborhood and something actually did happen there that he had no control over. Yeah. I've tried reaching Brent Patterson for comment, but he has not responded. Important to note, no charges have been filed. In fact, Firefighters right after this fire said no foul, foul play was suspected, but they continued to look into it. Live in Gwinnett County, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News.